Hey, boys and girls, today we're learning about wholes and equal parts. So a whole is like a whole square or a whole cookie. You see how it's just one whole, but it can be separated into equal parts. Equal parts means all shares or sizes are the same size. So here is one whole square, but they split it into four equal parts. You see how all four pieces are the same size? So there are four equal parts. You can go through and count them. One, two, three, and four. So this is another equal part. This is a whole right here, and it's been split into how many equal parts? One, two. You can split things in different ways. Like, have you ever tried to split a cookie with a friend? And you want to give them equal parts or equal shares, so you might cut the cookie in half, and you want to be fair. So. How many equal parts are here? Here we have a square that's cut into equal parts. We have one, two equal parts. So we would count one, two, and then put two down here. How many equal parts is the circle in? One, two, three, four. So there are four equal parts. This is asking us to draw a line for the equal part. So two equal parts so we split it into how many pieces guys two split it right down here we go now we have one two equal parts this wants to us to split it into four equal parts so let's start right about here one one two is that am i done no it wants four equal parts one two one two three still not done one, two, three, four. Now it's split into four pretty much equal parts. All right, number five. Write how many equal parts. We have one, two. Over here, how many do we have? One, two, three, four. What about down here, guys? One, two, three, four four equal parts how many equal parts are in this triangle one two two equal parts so draw lines to show equal parts four equal parts so let's look over here how they split this so right down the middle they split it in half but are we done guys no, it wants four equal parts. We need to split it one more time in half like that to make four equal parts. Oh, we have a trapezoid here. Let's think. If I split my trapezoid like this, would it be equal? No, because the top and the bottoms are very different. So I split it down the middle like this, it won't work. But what if I split it just like this? Look, here we have two equal parts. Okay, guys, so it's going to try to trick you just a little bit on some of the problems, maybe. Which shape is an equal part? Is this equal? If you and your friend were splitting this circle, pretend it's a cookie, would it be equal if one person got this much and one person got this much? No, so this is not an equal part. Is this an equal part? Let's see. It's split into one, two, three four parts and they're all about the same size so this is an equal part what about this one guys do you think this is an equal part no this part is much bigger than these parts over here that just would not be fair all right guys it's time for you guys to get started in the homework thank you bye